to Angelica's Corner. My name is Angelica and in today's video I am going to share with you guys my change update. So pretty much how much I've saved so far in change. So let's get right into the video. Okay so it's currently this is the money I'm going to be putting in here. Let's see how much because I don't even remember how much it was the last time I was here. So let's put the money in here. I have $68 with 94 cents so let me write that down right now so I have this little notebook that I write things down certain things like this I'll write right in so what is it 68.94 so right now my coin coin coins for right now is June so it's 617 right now so I'm going to put that my total is 68, starting 94, and let's see what we end up, the what will be next. As of now, it's 68.94. So how is everyone? How is it going? I wanted to talk about certain goals. Um budget wise uh is there like like so far my goals right so right now i don't know if you saw my last video i was talking about how i had to do this repair to my house outside it was like a foundation issue that i had going on so that needed to be done um it was priority and pretty much that depleted my savings um so right now my savings not looking good and I'm very worried because I don't know if you guys have this, but I get very worried when my savings, like if it goes even under a thousand, I'm very worried and stressed because I don't have like, I don't know about you, but <sighs> savings is when you have a backup saving, right? Like an emergency fund, it makes you feel a little bit better. Like a lot of, I know a lot of people feel this way. Um... For the reason that you know that if any cut in case of any massive emergency or something that you may need money um you have that there so i personally since i started budgeting my, my i've always tried to have at least a grand save always one thousand dollars um if i could get more than that even better i feel way better but this is the first time in a few years that my emergency fund has it's literally under a gram so i am very worried I've had a lot of do a lot of car repairs as well. Find, uh, my car is getting to the point now that it's starting because I've been driving far and all this stuff. My car has been having these issues, and every time I take it to the shop to get repair, I'm talking about two to three hundred dollars, four hundred dollars. Last time I went was four hundred dollars, and honestly, um, the problem is still happening. So they, it's like they didn't do anything to it. So it all comes down to, um, what are you comfortable with, like? And then there's always other stuff in life going on, you know, that you need money for. Like, I have other sinking funds. So, I am thinking of starting right now a... I'm going to be doing a savings challenge. And a savings challenge will be either for... One, I want to do one for Christmas. And I also want to do one for um, my emergency fund. Because Christmas is around the corner and I need to have this emergency fund up. I am also going to be taking a small vacation soon in the next let's say two to three months and um but that's money like that's different you know like i'll talk more about that later on so you know that's like my worry right now that i need to start making more money that too so i could target you know target all of these areas faster and so that's where i'm at right now so here we go the last one pimp let's look at it Right now, um, my total is seventy four fifteen, seventy four fifteen. Which is how crazy is that, guys? I almost have a hundred dollars save. I'm, I'm, I know I'm not near, but of only coins, straight up coins. So seventy four fifteen. So as a six seventeen, I started with sixty eight ninety four. Now I'm down to seventy four. Now I'm up to seventy four fifteen. And I'll tell you this, this is not all the coins, because sometimes I do use my coins, like I'll pay, like if it's like, you gotta pay 15 cents or so, I will pay with that, 
that way so that just goes to show you how crazy is that that this is literally halfway already full and my goal is, my goal is next year um to open in the beginning of the year like in january is when i want to tap into this so i think it's possible i'm getting there um that's gonna be a new thing that i want to do every year just you know i do it for one year so I, wanna, I literally want to open this in January, the first week of January. I want to cash it into, uh, you know, so, because I want to use it for something. Okay, so as of now, that is my um, totals and coins. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe down below. If you want to share anything of goal-wise that you have for budgeting right now, that you're working out, any savings challenges that you're working for, let me know in the comments below. I appreciate you guys. I hope that you guys all have an amazing day, weekend, afternoon, whatever time of the day it is. Don't forget to subscribe and give it a like because it really supports my channel and click the notification bell so every time I post a video you will get notified. Thank you and I will see you all in my next video.